let us differentiate this function here. Now, it is saying the fifth root of 3x plus 4 divided by 7 minus 5x cubed. Now, this says the fifth root. Let's rewrite it as 3x plus 4 raised to a power. So you have y is equal to 3x plus 4 raised to the power of. It would be 1 fifth. And this is divided by 7 minus 5x raised to the power of 3. Now, we could use the quotient rule here. Alright? So in that case, dy by dx is equal to let's hold the denominator hold the bottom f I said minus 5x to the 3 differentiate the top the numerator so we're going to find b by dx of 3x plus 4 to the 1 fifth minus hold the top the numerator 3x plus 4 to the power of 1 fifth and the time, find the derivative of with respect to x of 7 minus 5x to the power of 3 all divided by 7 minus 5x to the power of 3 squared all right well, we've run out of space so far. Let's open another screen and continue. So, 7 minus 5x cubed. So, dy by dx is equal to 7 minus 5x cubed. So, dy by dx equals 7 minus 5x cubed. The derivative of this is 1 fifth 3x plus 4. So we have 1 fifth 3x plus 4 to the power of 1 fifth minus 1 to the power of 1 fifth minus 1. What's 1 fifth minus 1? 1 fifth minus 1 is the same as 1 fifth minus 5 fifth. So what we have 1 minus 5, 1 fifth minus 5 fifth. 1 of anything minus 5 of that gives you negative 4. So it's negative 4 fifth. So let's rewrite this as a negative 4 fifth. Alright. So we have that part. Then minus 3x plus 4 to the 1 fifth minus 3x plus 4 to the power of 1 fifth and the derivative of 7 minus 5x cubed. Now, the inside function, when you differentiate 7 minus 5x with respect to x, you're going to get negative 5. So, this is negative 5 times, when you differentiate the outside function, 7 minus 5x cubed with respect to 7 minus 5x cubed, we're going to get 3, 7 minus 5x to the power of 2. So, it's 3, 7 minus 5x. Let me rewrite that. Oh. Something went wrong here. I accidentally put up two other screen. So let me remove them. Alright. So what we have here. Yes. 3 by 7 minus 5x to the power of 2. So. It's going to be 3 times. 7 minus 5x to the 2 all over 7 minus 5x cubed squared 2, 3 is 6 so it's going to be 7 minus 5x to the power of 6 7 minus 5x to the power of 6 alright so dy by dx is equal to now this will be 7 minus 5x 
cube one fifth of that let's put the one fifth in front by right, three x plus four to the negative four fifth to the negative four fifth minus three x plus four to the one fifth time negative five by negative three is negative 15 so this would become minus negative 15 times that minus negative 15 3 x plus 4 to the 1 fifth times 7 minus 5 x squared all over 7 minus 5 x to the sixth all right Now, let's have a closer look at it. Suppose we should divide both top and bottom by 7 minus 5x squared. Then dy by dx would become, now this is 1 fifth. This would be 7 minus 5x cubed over 7 minus 5x squared. We're dividing by 7 minus 5x squared. So this would leave 7 minus 5x and then what would happen to this? Let's keep this. Alright, let's write this as the fifth root of 3x plus 4. The fifth root of 3x plus 4 to the negative 4. Let's rewrite it like that. This would become plus. Or right, let's just let's just keep it. With this power. Let's not rewrite it like that. Let's just keep it as a power of. So it's 3x plus 4 to the power of negative 4 fifth plus 15. And then we have 3x plus 4 to the power of 1 fifth and 7 minus 5x square over it over 7 minus 5x square would be one so that's gone and this would be 7 minus 5x to the 6 divided by 7 minus 5x squared will become 7 minus 5x to the power of 4 so that's what we would have whoa all right so that's it for that um question i'll see you in the next video